Hey sippers, welcome back to another video. So Nicki Minaj is making it clear that these rap girls are no bodies. And that is Cardi B, Megan Thee Stallion, and you know, those other girls that who would have had a problem with Nicki being relevant, allegedly, okay? Now, I feel like Nicki knows her power and she is using it to the fullest extent because y'all know she has the Lochi shoe wear collection that is going to drop Friday, honey. And everybody has been super excited, anticipating the whole look. Listen, she is listing out her accomplishments. She said sneaker line out tomorrow. Her Pink Friday perfume is selling out. Her Pink Friday nails is loved. And let's talk about the Gag City record breaking tour. Her album went platinum. She has her own record label and she has peace within and more surprises coming soon. But let's discuss what she wrote before. And I feel like this is a shock to Meg. Nikki said, Nikki only collaborates with, well, I guess your faves are all nobodies who can compete because they've all gotten the collaboration they requested. Silly Wabbits. Gag City Tour has already made history for being the most successful tour by a female rapper in history after only 17 shows. Nikki is saying, sweetheart, I naturally get brand deals. I don't go out seeking brand brand deals it's because Nikki's saying that's the difference between you and me Meg like I already broke the record so if you're doing this hot girl summer tour it's gonna be nothing okay listen I love the energy that Nikki has and she is making her mark she is saying you know what y'all could call me granny y'all could say I don't have a Grammy but at the end of the day I'm still pushing weights I'm still overachieving things that you guys haven't achieved but only a Grammy and I'm super here for it because so many people have been sleeping on Nikki and I feel like she has every right to brag about her accomplishments because when they are ready, sweetheart, they drag her in the most disrespectful way ever. Because I feel like the only reason why Megan is doing this whole tour is because she saw how Nikki was going at it for Gag City. And I feel like these girls, they're super pissed and jealous of Nikki. So Megan is still hurt by the whole Bigfoot distract and the stay in your Tory lanes, whatever. You know, I feel like Megan is like, oh really? Girl, I'm gonna provoke you. Anything that you do, Nikki, I'm gonna do too. So you're on a Gag City tour. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a song and it's gonna be his and I'm gonna disrespect your husband. That way I could get some clout and then I'm gonna use that clout and and that relevance and make a tour hot girl summer tour so with that being said i feel like megan is delusional because can she see the only reason why she's thriving right now is because of nikki using nikki's name in whatever situation is going to give you clout because nikki is the clout okay and Cardi B has been talking about this album since the bc honey because listen i've been waiting I'm like, why is Cardi B so scared to drop this album? Is, is it because she knows she's not that a you know good rapper? She's not such a talented rapper. I'm asking these questions, guys. I'm not saying that she's not talented because why would you be so scared? You dropped Invasion of Privacy and you were super confident when you were beefing with Nicki and you got that amount of clout. Why is you scared now? Make it make sense. I'm so happy Nicki's putting these girls to shame because sweetheart, listen, they want to come in and they want to kick Nicki off the radar and Nicki's here to stay. But let us know what y'all think down below in that comment section, guys. Do not forget to support our merch. We have around 40 products. Y'all need to check them out and thank you guys for sipping with us bye